You like it, Yana? Yeah. They asked her for two hundred dollars yeah. to get it back. I'll cook faster for this hot dog. <laughs> well, Stanley Cup. Who? So, like, Nothing out. gives like that birthday cake. Okay, so this is what my little area over here. And I love the the snap closure. Hey, girl. Today is Wednesday. I am picking y'all up pretty late. It is almost seven o'clock. I just got finished uploading. Well, I'm uploading it uploading it now, the vlog from yesterday, Deja's birthday, night is dance, and all of that good stuff. And I was like, let me call my girls because we got some packages. So I got, well, I got to show y'all the Timu haul. I got to show y'all what I picked up from Timu. It's a big box, and like a, I mean, bag. Okay, so I hope they big enough. So I used to purchase these on Amazon. And what I would do is put my thank you cards, stickers, the heart, and candy inside of these bags and include them in my packaging. Don't ask me why I stopped. I still include all of the items, just not inside of the bag. So I said I was gonna start back doing that. Yeah, I purchased these and they're cute. But this is a pack of, I don't even know. I wanna say 50, 50 or 100. I bought a LED portable photo studio. So it's like a light box. So I can put my products in it, it's white, or you can, I think you could change whatever color background you want. So it's like a little box and you can put your products in it and it has a LED light attached to it. So I purchased that. I'm not about to open it because I think you gotta like put, put it together or whatnot. Oh, I purchased this phone. This ain't got nothing to do with um, the packaging. I came across this phone and it was just so cute. Like it's a, uh oh. It's an actual telephone and it looks like that. <laughs> And I'm just gonna use it for decoration. I'm gonna put it somewhere in here. And I got this pink. I wish it was a little lighter because this pink is, I don't know. I'm, so, yeah, like I said, it's just strictly for decoration. And then I got some uh, thank you, I mean, not thank you, fragile stickers. Uh, I thought I ordered a lot of these. They might be just thrown. They just threw this stuff in here. Make sure you are signed up for my email notifications because sometimes, sometimes I do a little secret drop and you get access to the products early. So next I purchased these um, like inspirational scriptures cards <laughs> that I'm gonna put in the packaging. Don't be anxious about anything, girl. But in every situation, by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present, present your request to the Almighty God. He got you. He got you. So I got a few packs of these. I don't know. I think it's a pack of 50, right? I don't know why I just ripped it out. Oh, and it came with a new little, I mean, a cute little organza bag. I'm going to show enough reuse that. But I'm gonna put them in here for now because I didn't rip the plastic all open. Hopefully I ordered enough because like I said, sometimes I run out. So please don't be mad. What the heck is this? So please don't be mad if you don't get something. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, these are gloves. I'm like, what the, look at this. I'm like, what the heck is this? These are gloves, pink gloves. I got some other stuff mixed in here. I think this is a shirt for Naya because I think she already has some stuff in the cart and I just went on ahead and when I checked out, I just kept her stuff in the cart. But she got this shirt. Whoever that is. SZA. She's cute. I'm not real hip on these new new stars. I got some more of those bags. And I got these little decorative hearts. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. These are too small to just include, you know what I'm saying? I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. How many of these did I get? And what was I thinking? I think, I think I thought they were bigger. Yeah, I thought they were bigger. Darn it, I should've read. I should've seen how big they were. I thought these were like the bigger hearts that I usually include in my packaging. 
Hmm, this gotta be Naya's cause nah, I wouldn't wear nothing like that. I don't like snakes. Got more of these hearts. And then we got some other like little decorative. So maybe I can use them as decoration. But yeah, there's some more hearts, hearts, hearts. So it looks like I'm gonna have to order the hearts off of Amazon. What is this? Oh, this is Naya's. She got a Hello Kitty, uh, what is this, a uh, necklace. Then we got more of the scripture cards, more of the hearts. This one says pink 100. I don't know what this is. Whatever it is, it's a hundred of them. Oh, okay. Oh, I hope this is big enough. This don't look big enough. <laughs> so I ordered these boxes because I wanted to put package the body butters in them. You know, maybe like a limited edition body butter or something. <laughs> this doesn't look like it's gonna fit a butter. Oh, what was I even thinking? Like, what is this about to fit? I thought I was really doing something, y'all. This, I don't know what this would fit. Soap. Okay, this has turned out to be a fail, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, yeah, I guess I could put a bar of soap in here because I was thinking about bringing back the turmeric bar soap. Y'all have been asking me for it. I don't know why I purchased these two and these so little. Whew. I got some more fragile. Please handle with care, I'm fragile. So I don't know why I got those little things. Can't even really see that. You know, they don't pay, pay attention to them fragile stickers anyway. But look like more of these. And then these look like some more of the two little boxes. I guess I'll be getting on Amazon for my hearts. Because I got to have the hearts. I don't know what this is. It got my name on it. But I don't know what it is. I don't remember ordering anything electronic. Because obviously it has a battery. So let me see what this is. Oh! Oh, this is Deja's um, Steam Deck. So, some of y'all may know what this is already, but it's basically a handheld game, like the Nintendo Switch, I guess. But it's through Steam, you know, computer games through Steam. So you can play your Steam computer games. And Steam is a website or a app where you can download computer games. <laughs> That's what I got her for her birthday. She already knew about it because she's a like true gamer. She's always on a video game with her friends. They be like, sound like they be having a party in there. <laughs> they be so loud playing a video game. She knew about it or whatever. And she said she didn't think nothing of it until one of her friends brought it to work. One of her coworkers brought it to work. And he let her play with it while she was on break. She said she fell in love with it. She was like, she had to have it. Now, if y'all don't know, Deja is saving up to go to Japan. She's been throwing little hints since November. Like, you know, my birthday coming up, my birthday coming up. Can you, she actually asked me, can you get it, please? He begged me to get it. I said, no, you want to go to Japan, right? You still want my half, right? These kids, but you know me. But anyway, um, so I ordered it for it. Obviously it came a little late because her birthday was, what, four days ago. But I called her in here and I showed her like the confirmation email and she started crying. She started crying and she hugged me. And I wish y'all could have been a fly on the wall. That was, that was, that was bittersweet. Cause y'all know Deja. <laughs> that was definitely bittersweet. I know that was long. I know y'all like, girl. <laughs> But yeah, I'm about to put this by her door because she ain't home. I don't know if she went to work today or if she just out hanging. Now, she goes and hang out a lot, getting tattoos, nose piercings. I'm like, you better have your half. Like, don't play me because she probably figure, oh, if I don't have all of it, 
my mama just make up the rest. Shh. Watch, watch me not. And don't play with me. Don't, like I'm saying this now, but uh, anyway. But, but for real, don't play with me. Don't, don't play me like that. All right, so this is the box here. Now it does take about two weeks, about a week and a half. And this came by UPS. UPS dropped this off. And the reason it's in this big box is because they include bag and the box and everything. And I don't keep none of that. I just throw it away. I don't need none of that uh, extra, extra stuff. Ooh, we got two bags. I, I ordered a Prada bag, a Prada backpack. I love my little backpacks. This is the box. What's this? That's all the information right there. And there you go. The gift bag here a little envelope and i just throw all of this away i guess this would be good if you're trying to give it away as a gift or whatever all right so dust bag and it's a little mini little mini backpack i didn't want the big one i don't even think they sell the big one on their website this is the strap the chain it's a chain strap yeah it's just cute and dainty I should have looked into this better because I'm going to be, I'm not going to feel like closing it like this. So you have to, so you have to like buckle it. You know what I'm saying? You have to buckle it. And I'm not going to feel like doing all of that when I'm trying to open it and close it. I wish it was just a magnetic thingy. It's so cute though. The stitching is good. There's no stitching out of place. And I usually look at YouTube videos and I didn't with this bag. Didn't even read the measurement. I don't know, I might put this on the website. Put this back in here and I'm gonna package it all back up and I'm gonna include all of the stuff that it came with. So we got a Louis Vuitton bag. This is how it comes packaged. That product bag was $235. So I probably sell it for like $200. So you're getting a little bit of discount and you don't have to wait two weeks to get it. <laughs> um, but yeah, the Louis Vuitton stuff includes, you know, all of this, this stuff. Uh, let's see which one this is. Let me open it up. Got that same uh, like pamphlet. This is so cute. And I like it because it kind of look like the trunk bags, the shape, and then this like on the ends, the four corners. I love it. I love it. I love a lot of Louis Vuitton styles, but I just don't want to pay. <laughs> I just don't want to pay the money for it. And I think something like this is like $4,000. Like they're outrageous. Ooh, I like that it opens up wide. You know what I'm saying? Like you can really get in there. So it does include the chain and the strap. Yes, the strap is wide. What is this? Hmm, nothing. That's what it looks like in the inside. And this is nice and soft, almost like, I don't know, suede something. Oh, this is so cute. I love it. Got another chain. Let's see, the strap is a wide body. A black one. And it's the utility, so you can hang a um, thing on it. So you can hang one of the like coin purses or something on it. Nice. Nice. And this is thick. Like this feels good. And it has all of the, you know, Louis Vuitton writing on it. It even has it like right there. Um, of course on the hardware. Oh, and I didn't show y'all the inside of the Prada bag, but I got the, um, it says Prada right there. I'm not gonna remove that. And then in the inside, it, it says Prada all in the inside of the bag. 
yeah I'm just not a fan of this so yeah I'm gonna stuff it back like it was what's up y'all I'm heading out me and Naya do y'all still got y'all kids names all twisted and mixed up Naya's at school me and Yana is about to step out just for a hot second. Yesterday, or was it the day before? One of the days I went to Walmart to pick up some boxes and I seen this cookware set that I thought was cute. It's pink, I'll show it to y'all in a minute. But I instantly thought of her and I remember her telling me months ago that she needed some new cookware. And I know she still got the same cookware set that I gave her when she first moved into her apartment. I texted her this morning. Well, actually she texted me asking me to confirm um, if y'all watch her vlogs her Instagram had got hacked and she needed me to confirm on my Instagram that I knew her or whatever so she can get her account back so I had told her I had bought her a new cookware set and she was like oh I'm coming to get it today and I was like okay cool and I was like you want to go to home goods because <laughs> I know she like um you know TJ Maxx home goods she into that now that she now that she's out on her own I thought I'll treat her to um a little mommy daughter day oh she here so let me go what you down here doing like shampoo on the carpet no mm -hmm. that's what they did to mine you like it yana yeah i figured that it was that one i've seen that one multiple times really <laughs> oh it just happened yeah what was it? They emailed you or something yeah they emailed you. it was kind of funny it was like they emailed me like I have your Instagram. I was like, okay, give it back. Right, okay, give it back. <laughs> so it was like, you've been randomly selected by my system. Wonderful boy. <laughs> that was so Some funny. hacker or something. Yeah, right. And obviously from another country because you know, yeah. like we're saying, like sent by iPhone, like all that stuff, it was all a different language. They asked her for $200 yeah. to get it back. So how did you get it back? So, so I, so they have an option where you can like, you can request like friends to confirm your identity uh -huh. and they give you a list to pick from. Luckily, Mama and Deja was on there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I just clicked the, them two and then they had to confirm. Yeah. Right? Like, yeah. I mean, yeah. All it said yeah. was when you text me, yeah. it said that I went into my Instagram and it was like right there at the top, okay. like confirm. Do you know this person yeah. or something? And I put confirm and it yeah. said, okay. Yeah, because, so how do you protect it from now on? Though? Well, now I have that two, two, two step. Yeah. 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 You should that. always have on everything. I didn't know Instagram had that. Though. Everything got because that. Because I had that account for, for, for whatever. Account. Yeah. So it probably yeah. wasn't. No, you probably it wasn't was. like that when she first signed oh, up. Maybe not, no. Yeah. No, it definitely wasn't. I had that Instagram for like eight years. Like, yeah, because yeah, his Steam account got hacked. Yeah, some Chinese dude was playing games and getting banned. <laughs> yeah, he was playing all of his games. <laughs> he had so he bought so many games on this account, and they, he just they just I wasn't was using my Steam for a while. I was playing games on like epic other yeah. things. So I went back to my Steam, and it's like he banned. I'm like banned. <laughs> 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 and everything was in Chinese and he was making all of these transactions. He was like he was like selling like little uh like I don't know what you call them, like icons or something. Like little thumbnail, like things you put the, for your picture or something. Yeah, the profile like, pictures. Yeah, yeah, he was like selling them and all that. That's what was all in my account. Mm -mm -mm. Then you, then something else happened on yeah, the they, scene. They had my rock star. That's not. Yeah. Scene. Oh they yeah. My rock star. They stole all my. They stole grand. They all the grand. They stole everything. Right. And he was from China. Bugs. Yeah, he, he stole all the grand. They auto. anything I had on Rockstar, He stole it though. I had to rebuy Red Dead Redemption Two. All the stuff I had, I had to rebuy it if I wanted to play it. Mm mm so, mm. Because I can't get into his account. I don't know his 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 asking me for his uh, password. Yeah. Okay, because Yana got something to do, so we got to go. Yeah, it's, it's funny how somebody always claiming they're broke, always doing something. I was just saying, always. I am broke, right. That never changed. You know what that means. That means they only got money for certain stuff. Yeah, what they want to do. I'm literally broke. I am. She got that big Disney 100 on her tag. You're being Deja bought that from. Uh, the Disney, uh, dog. Oh, you're a Disney bubba now. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I used to put them in the bathroom. Yeah. They don't really last that long, yeah, though. Yeah, I was going to say. Mm -hmm. This is cute, the pineapple. Yeah, I don't know. 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 Yeah, I
Oh yeah, sometimes it do be a little oh, cheaper. Nice. Yeah, be different. Uh, probably maybe about a dollar. It don't be yeah, no, no like more than that. Cheaper. Yeah. Yeah, that is. So this is cute. It's like say coconut, pineapple coconut. That should smell good. Mm, washing machine cleaner. Clean your washing machine. Mm-hmm. That's cute. What's that? Oh, honey, honey sweet lemon. honey lemon. Yeah. Smells good. Mmm, that does. That's another one. Yeah. 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 That smells, good. smells real good. I'm gonna put it in the uh, kitchen, even though it don't match my kitchen at all. <laughs> oh, I got these, y'all. This mixing bowl set with lids. I need some bigger bowls. I got like the red, like Tupperware, you know, but they're small. I need bigger, bigger bowls. Not necessarily for mixing, but to store. Yeah, say food. Great for mixing and food storage. Tenacious. Oh, this is a cast iron brush scraper. Oh, right. And we all whispering. I was trying to tell Caleb, I'm like, because he's like not shy, but you know, mm -hmm. yeah. you, know how, you know, people are on camera for like mm -hmm. the first time in public. Yeah. I'm like, you just like, people don't care. So, yeah. Or they look at you. Or you shouldn't what? care. That's yeah, the whole yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As I said, I was like, I was like, okay, okay they look at you. Now what? You're not going to say something to you. know, you know what I mean? Right. Like, yeah. Like, even if they did say something, just. You know, mm, like, I just look at them, smile, and keep going. Yeah, like, so, I mean. Like, you want to be in it? Right. <laughs> I'm so used to it. I just had tunnel vision. I don't yeah. even really be seeing people. <laughs> I don't even really be paying attention at people looking at me. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's nice. Yeah. See, that's some of them things that you don't think you need, but no. you really need. Right. No, yeah, you do. I you kind of really, if you have like the little small thing, because I have bought like this, um, let me see if they got it, like a meat chopper to mash up like the turkey meat and hamburger meat. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. you would look at it like, uh, I'll just use my spatula, right. but, but now that you use it, it really mints yeah. the meat really good. Need some more of these, but I don't like the ones that looks like this because you keep putting them in a the dishwasher. Oh. It come on yeah. like loose from the glue and then the water starts seeping down in there. Yeah. And then when you use it, the water oh. drip in Ew. your food is disgusting. Yeah, I don't get none. It's like that. I don't like it because like this part starts to get like all burnt know, up like, and yeah. kind of like yeah. You know, like, but you can't up. use it chewed up. <laughs> but you can't use any like that on right, a, like on a um, on a, the non-stick non pots. Yeah. I'm always tapping something. They always be talking about me when I, cause somebody asks like, why would you show us stuff? You always tapping. Girl, it's a habit. It's a habit. Just like I talk with my hands. Right, I be, yeah. It's just a habit. Mm -hmm. It's not how my pants go like back. It's not like this. It goes back. I guess. I don't remember what that thing looked like. But it goes like back. Uh -huh. It's like really annoying. Because you got food in the back. Mm -hmm. But I want it all to kind of be up front. Like, I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah, you you got any of these like this no, type stuff? Really like you can put. I know. I, know. I don't really like to take stuff out of a box that is already in and put it in there. I don't know. I feel like that's just doing too much. <laughs> yeah, I feel you. That's why I'm like, shout out to the girlies with that aesthetic. Right. Well, yeah, I, I can't even talk. The aesthetic <laughs> exactly. pantry and the refrigerator. Yeah, I, I don't have time. Right. I mean, I do, but I don't. I don't feel like doing all of that. It's, it's cute though. It's cute, but I just don't have time. Because it already comes in a pack. I take it out and put it in another Well, I think to keep it fresher. Because, you know, you just fold in the bag and then it just keeps it fresh. I mean, it'd be looking pretty, like really nice. Mm-hmm. Reusable sandwich bags. This is glass. What you can put in there is like any kind of packets. Like, you know, maybe say... Or like, <laughs> or like gravy packets or anything, you know, okay. I don't know. I'm not doing a whole mess with those gravy. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, I don't cook. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> I don't that. That's what I was just telling them. I had told them that you still using the cookware set that I yeah. gave you when you first moved in. Right. I said, I know it's probably in good condition, but still. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah. Some of the pots are burnt because, like, I'm trying to cook hash browns. <laughs> you don't be putting enough oil and you got the temperature up too high. Mm -hmm. Gotta cook it on like medium. Cook faster when it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> she said cook faster when it's a lie. <laughs> See, I don't have the time for that either because you you actually have to chop it up smaller and to put it in there and then you gotta clean that after. So I just rather just get my little cutting board and the knife out and just chop it all up myself. I always say I need a new water bottle, but don't. <laughs> Ain't got a lot sitting around. Oh, I like this one though. Shoot, Stanley Cup who? Yeah, I'm not gonna get one, even though I'm I'm itching to. I'm itching. Oh, look, they got a whole pink stuff, a little kit yeah. thingy. That's pretty cool. Thirty bucks. Oh yeah, I got yeah. one of those. Yeah, that, that's yeah. good. Because, like, yeah, I got one. If I just put a towel down, it's just not ten dollars. Where's <laughs> what? <laughs> Okay, for this though, viewers, $10 for this. This is about like $5 in my mind. It's like, girl, put that in a buggy and come on. Because we're not okay, doing this today. If, if you we're not doing it. Why I like this green though? It's cute. I get St. Patrick. Oh, no, it's not. Well, yeah, it is. It got hearts. Yeah. I don't know. I like that. Dish towels. I mean, I do, but. I do too, cause I don't know what be happening in my stuff like that. It just be getting ate up. Oh, I do need some more of these type of, um, like these microfiber, um, for Velvety Vibes, cause we go through like these. We go through these so much because these are so good for cleaning up oil. Let me get the green ones. But yeah, this is so good for like body butters and oh, any oils. It it's wipes it right up oh you like mushrooms yeah. i seen the, the vlog when you and caleb was at yeah. somewhere and it was like the cute the mushroom i said you know what i said i was gonna do i said i was gonna go to the store and i was gonna buy it but i forgot i just what didn't mushroom? have time Wait, i don't know i think y'all was in that bills, bills? or oh, it's, oh, it's called bills yeah it was like it the bills? mushroom bells or bills? yeah was it like was it like a ceramic thing yeah no it was glass it was glass i don't know yeah, but yeah. Yeah, I said I was going to go get it for you because yeah. you saw what it cost too much. I said, let me go up there and get this for her. But I forgot. But I might as well get this one because this is cute. Mm -hmm. And it costs, and it's cheaper than this one. <laughs> well, no, this is, But it's wait. the same thing. It's a drying rack. That's a drying thingy. It's a drying rack. Oh, so it absorbs. This, okay. Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. This one, $10. That one, seven ninety nine. So... <laughs> Shopping less. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm gonna get another pack of these because it's only 12. Like I said, we go through these, so get another pack. I'm gonna try this brand because I can't remember the brand that I be getting because I'm always getting. Oh, they're playing with one of those little duck toys. Oh, what's that right there? That black, you know, black always catch my eye. No, it's like that checkered black. Yeah, what is that? Oh, how much that's is that? Cute. Yeah. I do like that. It's only $7.99. Okay, yeah, that's just, just grab yeah, that. It's cheaper than our Marshalls, for <laughs> sure. Because, like, that would probably be like $12.99 at ours. Yeah. What? <laughs> this is ghetto. <laughs> this is ghetto. Oh, they got the matching um oh. thing where you set yeah, the. Oh, right? how much is that? $3.99? $4.99? <laughs> this would be like $10 at ours. You sure? Yeah. Oh, I only need one. I've been in and out of that place. <laughs> I know Wait, this one kind of scratched up. Let me get the other one. <laughs> this one got hit. <laughs> is this one better? Oh, no, nah, that one worse. <laughs> I don't like, know if I want this then. Because, like ooh, I don't like the ooh. Yeah, you feel that? Like it's that like, idea. ooh. <laughs> mm, I don't like ooh. that. <laughs> is this like that? Yeah. It is. But you're not really touching that. It's for like, you know how somebody like be cringy when somebody scrape their fingernails against the yeah. chalkboard? That's how this feels. Cause it's like matte right here. Hmm. Kitchen organizer rack. Oh, I could use this. This is five ninety nine. I can put this down in the I'm trying to see if I can use this in my cabinet. 
because right now I just got like stuff like this just thrown in the drawer, like stacked on top of each other. But I'm trying to see. Yeah. Will it be too tall though if mm -hmm. I stand it up? Because it is a shelf. Right. On top, so I don't know it. Yeah, I think it'll be too tall. Cause. Yeah, I'm not gonna get it. Oh, this is a tablet stand. This is nice. Hmm. Do I need this? I don't, because I can, my tablet, my, uh, <laughs> just see, <laughs> what is that, oh, like a, oh, that's cute, yeah, put the olive oil in there. And you get two, they sell one of these at ours for like $15, I'm not You gotta show me, next time you go vlog it and then show me, because I can't remember, now this is the same, well, maybe because... This is home goods. Like you go to TJ Maxx though. No, oh, the one in yeah. Winter Garden. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know I stayed in there too, and I don't I remember the prices being that much of a difference. Oh that's why I barely get anything. I'm like, okay. <laughs> you said that's why I barely get anything. <laughs> I barely get anything. I'm like, y'all doing too much. Now y'all remember all of that noise? Why they let their kid destroy that? Well, they ain't destroy the aisle, but why they let them leave all of them toys? Uh -oh. Uh, I'm trying. <laughs> they let them leave all of these toys in this aisle like that. And Yana gonna be a good Samaritan and pick them all up. Mm -hmm. My schedule's about to change. Really? Yeah, I'm about to be working 11 to 7.30 now. Set up 8.30 to 5. Because, oh, yeah. you, do you like that? Yes. Oh, you do? I'm trying to wake up so early. I, I don't know. I need time in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's kind of pros and cons to that. Oh, you know what someone said in the comments? Remember we talked about the glasses and the nose and the wideness? <laughs> they said try Asian fit. Because they said they was having... Yeah, the bridge. This part right here. She said try Asian fit. Because she said she had the same problem and she was getting Asian fit glasses. And um, Because like if you go on the websites, I do remember it saying, like it'll say Asian fit. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, because it like... Yeah, I knew I was a trip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so shout out to, I forgot her name, but I'll put the comment up. Shout out to you, girl. So Yana said, she's trying to see if it's the same candle that her and Caleb smelled on her vlog that, that smelled really like boo-boo. Boo-boo well, like, or booty. Like so this is that same candle. Remember, TJ Maxx. But this one looks a lot lighter than the oh. other one. The other one was like super, like a dark chocolate brown. I'm scared. No, this. See, it's something wrong with y'all. <laughs> something wrong with your whole goods. Wait, wait, hold on. It kind of has that hint. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let me see. <laughs> it smells this bug. Don't be dramatic what? like Gage. Oh my god. Trust me. Let me see. Oh my god. Three times. Like smell it once. Oh yeah, <laughs> I see what she said. This, nah, she not exaggerating. This junk stay. Yeah. I told you. That's like. Literally like. I wouldn't want that burning in my house. That look cute. That lemon splash. Yeah. What this one? That's cute. Yeah. But some of those ones that be cutesy like that don't be doing nothing. What this brand is good is the DW Home. Um. Oh yeah, say scented candle. Yes, that smells good. It's but pretty. Like, I wouldn't even want to burn that because it's so pretty. Yeah. yeah they, oh yeah, because once you start burning, yeah, the melt it's gonna look melt. dumb. Okay, y'all, I lied. I'm getting this birthday cake. This smells so good. How much is it? And look at the packaging. Like, oh, soon as you like, soon as I opened it, you just it's like a powerful whiff. Like I think this gonna do what it's supposed or give what it's supposed to give. How much is this? $16.99. I'm gonna put this in the kitchen. Oh, it's more over here in this basket. So I told her to grab one from out of here because they haven't stocked it yet. So nobody probably ain't been sniffed on. They ain't been sniffed on yet. Ooh, island retreat. I keep thinking that's somebody coughing. I was about to say, get away from, I was, that's why I keep looking around. Like, stay far away from me with that cough now. Nah. Like, I don't know what, what that is. Far away from me. See, don't yeah. see it's not like somebody coughing. This smells so good too. 
it's not as good as that because that makes you just yeah. want to start licking. Yeah, this one's like, <laughs> more like a soft. Yeah. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> man, this smells so good. I'm going to put this back because I've been and got that too. <laughs> Smell this one. This is by Martha Stewart as well. You I'm know. scared. Right. I'm scared. Say spa. That one smells good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but nothing like when you open it, it doesn't like nothing out. gives like that birthday cake as soon as you open right. that birthday cake it's like because as soon as she opened yeah, it she was it. like oh that's strong birthday cake i feel like it gives me a headache if i like that for too long mm. you know what i mean like i have to like light it for like 10 minutes and i'm done yeah because i had a few birthday cake ones my hair is like is it giving my hair yeah. you are always giving honey <laughs> Okay, wouldn't y'all think this would be false advertisement? Because it's a red series. Don't, Yana just flipped this around. So it was like this. So you thinking, oh, okay, it might be red at the bottom. Because it's a red series. So you thinking it might be, you know, I had a little touch of red at the bottom. And I was like, is it really red at the bottom? Because they got the background red. But nope. Sorry. And when you turn it around. Okay. But yeah, it's just regular old glasses. Those are kind of big. <laughs> Beignet all day. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's cute. Got Tiana on the back. Oh, it's a dragon. Where? Where are you? Oh, right? Is it? <laughs> Where the head? <laughs> oh, I don't know what that thing is. What's going on there? <laughs> right? I don't know. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> How you gonna drink out of that? Oh, I don't think it's a. That's the <laughs> job. Is it? Is it? it has to be. Wait, we in. What store we in? It's a TJ Maxx. Oh, it does. Yeah, look. Is it what store are we in? <laughs> so you know, all these stores the same. Yeah. Are you supposed to? Yeah. I don't like that. That's cute. Yeah. Oh, I love you. Gotta be like something for decoration. Yeah. I spy Mickey. Me and uh, <laughs> Naya always do that when we go like in a store. Yeah. We'd be like, I spy Hello Kitty or I spy <laughs> Mickey or Disney. If this was like a regular size plate, I would get it. But that lady down the aisle was like, she went and got her body done. Basically. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Y'all, them same kids. Yana, they under there. <laughs> Where is they? Give me. I didn't know I wasn't going to vlog it when they first was down that aisle because I didn't want to put them on camera, but I didn't know they was under it playing. Oh my, where is they parents at? I just seen a little head move. <laughs> I was just trying to show y'all how they jacked up that aisle. Right, the, where is the parents? Forget a worker, where is they mama? <laughs> y'all, they got their phone under there. They just made just a little <laughs> They had the whole they phone under there just having a little good old time. And the little girl peeked her head up. I said, y'all having fun, ain't y'all? And she gonna say, she gonna start laughing and then go back under. <laughs> These are cute. I got them in black house shoes. The gray. Then they got the pink ones. But we about to check out. We didn't do that much damage. These are the cloths for Velvety Vibes. I got the candle. Um, Yana got this notebook. And then this is her candle. This is hers. That um, vinegar. Well, she's going to use it for oil, I believe. And then we got the um, this bee hand soap. Should be another one somewhere in here. Yeah, my smile's over there. Oh, and I did get this brush. And she got the drying mats. I got the bowls. Oh, and I got this edge control. My curls. And then she got these loofahs. That's it. some meatloaf so it's hours later it is 4 
o'clock and I had a taste for some meat loaf. So I'm gonna cook some meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and we still got some leftover green beans. I should have bought some more of those dinner rolls. The mugs are so good. These bowls are so freaking cute and they're perfect for like mixing the meatloaf in here because I, I do not have no bowls this big. Like all of my bowls is probably around this size. And that's this is not even the biggest size. Look at that. So yeah, I already washed this one out. I just got to dry it out though. The other ones I didn't wash out yet. I got my pan, meatloaf pan, Food Network. Like all of my like bacon pans and pizza pans, muffin pans, cake pans is Food Network. I got some potatoes. And I think someone asked me um, like months ago when I made meatloaf was the mashed potatoes homemade girl i have to have homemade mashed potatoes like i cannot and have never been able to do the box uh mashed potatoes that's why at the restaurants i never get mashed potatoes because i don't know if they're gonna be homemade or not when i was a kid my mama used to get what was called focus hope which was like um a, 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 it was a form of aid to help with food <laughs> like wick so you would go down to this building and you would get Focus Hope cheese. Like that cheese was the best though. <laughs> they changed it since then. It don't taste as good as it did. Oh, making um a cheese toast. Cut that because it used to come in logs. I don't know if Focus Hope was like everywhere. I just know it was in Detroit when I was growing up. But it was like a log of cheese and you would cut it. Put that cheese on some bread, throw it in the broiler, because back then we ain't had no toaster oven. We had the regular old oven and you put it at the bottom down here, put it on broil. Oh, that was the best. And it made the best macaroni and cheese. The powdered eggs was good. Um, oh, it was this meat. It was like this pork that came in a can. And I think, I don't even think it had a name. It just said pork, I think. And it was a picture of a pig. <laughs> that junk was good. My mama used to whip that up with some rice. Um, I'm pretty sure it was a lot of other things, but I couldn't get with the mashed potatoes. I, I couldn't get with the instant, not mashed potatoes. I couldn't get with the instant mashed potatoes. But anyway, so we got some milk for the um, mashed potatoes. I bought some cheese for the mashed potatoes. I bought some panko breadcrumbs for the meatloaf. And I brought some baked beans because Anaya and Cleveland like baked beans. So they might eat baked beans instead of the green beans. So I just bought a can of that. And then I got some tomato sauce and some chicken stock because I'm most likely going to make some gravy. So I'm going to put this um, salsa in the meatloaf because it's basically, it's not real like this is what it looks like so all it is is chopped up onions tomatoes and green peppers and a little seasoning but i'm about to put this in there instead of cutting up my own i mean i have i have it but this is already cut up i purchased this um when i made that chili the other night and i put this in it and it tastes too good like the it even it smells so good so what's in it is tomatoes onions green peppers oh it's cucumber red pepper chili pepper cilantro tomato juice lime juice salt and garlic like and i got this from bj's i think i didn't bring my tripod down so y'all can't even see i would have to hold on i'm gonna set y'all up in a minute y'all let me know what y'all put in y'all meatloaf i don't know this is the way i've been cooking it since i've been i don't know 16 <laughs> cooking for my um my brothers and sister and my sister will be here next month <laughs> she texted me uh, a couple days ago and was like we'll be down for paul which is her boyfriend birthday and uh she was making sure we was gonna be here <laughs> i'm like we are going on a cruise we'll be back by the 25th <laughs> put my seasonings in even though this I already have garlic right yeah this has garlic but hey <laughs> I love garlic, so a little, a little more garlic won't hurt. Pepper, and I eyeball everything for the most part. And let me hurry up because my battery is 
blinking and I do not feel like going upstairs with another one. Salt, pepper, gotta do a smoked paprika. Put a little bit of poultry seasoning. You know what salt I grew up on? Laurie's. Laurie seasoning salt, but I, I stopped buying it a long time ago because that stuff is just, oh, this is too much. <laughs> when I stopped buying it and using it, I switched over like to a better salt because I love salt. <laughs> I ain't as bad as my mama, and that's where I probably got it from, but I, I like salt. So I switched over to like Himalayan salt. And my mama, she she uses that too. She uses Himalayan. So it's a, a little a little better, right? I'm honestly gonna use this gourmet burger seasoning. This stuff is so good. It's just like all the flavors, just it's it's really good. So I used this on the turkey, turkey legs last night. Okay, so got that mixed up. And then I'm gonna just dump this in here. Dump with some of it. Sorry, y'all, this is ghetto. I should have my tripod so I can kind of show y'all what's going on a little bit and i'm gonna put some tomato sauce in here uh -oh. making a whole mess i'm gonna use these breadcrumbs because i i usually like to use oatmeal but i like these breadcrumbs better the panko breadcrumbs so let's mix this all together throw it in this pan and hopefully <laughs> it turn out right all right the camera did die i had to run upstairs and get another one but this is the meatloaf and I don't put any ketchup or anything on top because no one likes it that way. I don't mind it, but I also don't care if it has it on there or not. Oh, and I did add eggs. Look at Naya's new Crocs. Hello Kitty Crocs. They came out, what day was this for? The 17th? Yeah, I'm just not getting them. Oh, they're so cute. I got an order from Nordstrom's. Remember, oh, I don't know if I told y'all, but I got another card case because I only have one that MCM card case that or card what no, card card wallet card case. I only got the one that MCM that I showed y'all the other day, so I bought another one. Tory Birch, I believe. No, this wasn't on sale. I also got a Tory Birch. Hold on. Let me fix myself. <laughs> Okay, so I got uh, Tory Burch watch bands. You know, some watch bands I can maybe wear when I dress up a little bit when we go out to dinner or whatnot instead of those same old silicone rubber um, bands. This might be an everyday band because it's, it's just, well, except when I get started working out. I'll switch to the silicone bands, but it's cute. They also had it in white. It is cute. And then I got some Tory Burch earrings, which is a little smaller than I thought they were, but I'm gonna still keep them because you know I don't like hoops or anything anyway. I really prefer studs, but these are fine. And and I like that it's silver and gold because I. Um, find myself mixing the metals at first uh oh at first i didn't like it now i'm starting to like it or now i'm just starting to not care <laughs> okay if y'all want to be on the vlog say hey You got a meatloaf. It's a little crispy on the top. But I blame y'all. Whoever was on my live, I blame y'all. So I went live. I was on there for about two hours. And I kind of, I ain't gonna say it's not burnt, but you see, it's, I thought it was gonna be all dried out. Somebody said they thought it was gonna be like a hockey puck. But no, it's still, I'm vlogging. <laughs> it's still juicy. You know what I'm saying? I still got the juices all down up in there. And it's good. They got a piece right here that I was eating on. And it's good. We want a mashed potato. But, um, yeah, so I went live. We was on there for about two hours. Maybe about two and a half. But I'm going to leave it up. Because when I go live, I get a little personal on the live. So, if y'all want to be nosy. <laughs> I did a couple story times. Um, 
yeah, just got a little personal. Um, I called one of my best friends. She was talking on the live on speakerphone. So yeah, I'm gonna leave it up. Cause I probably won't go live again for another, what, six months. <clears throat> the way I just coughed. <clears throat> That was something serious. I don't know what I be choking on. I told the older I get, it's like, what the heck? <laughs> like, I'm not even eating nothing. I guess it's my spit, my reflexes or something. I don't know, child, but I just be choking. So I thought I'd pick y'all up on this beautiful morning. Cause um, first of all, I'm out of breath. I had to go downstairs and get the camera. So I left y'all down there last night. So give me a minute. <laughs> I know y'all like, girl, why you ain't edit that out? I don't know. It's real life. I I, I just, I, I guess, I wanted y'all to see me cough. That I wanted to show y'all that I cough too. I be choking too. I don't know. <laughs> All right. So, um, as you can see, what I'm about to say. <laughs> y'all, let's do take two. Take two. I decided to pick y'all up this morning because I started rearranging my bags. So you know I always have my lounge fly bags on this side over here. So you know I sold a lot of them. A lot. I want to say I sold maybe about 15. I still got a lot. And these are the ones that I like wear. And the ones that I know I'm going to wear whenever we decide to go back to Disney World and Disneyland. So you know... Well, I know we're going to Disneyland in March. We're going back in March. We're going to be cruising out of LA. We getting on, what are we getting on? Princess. We getting on the Pri Diamond Princess, which is Princess Cruises' newest ship, I think. they The way they be popping out these ships, I don't know if it's the newest or not. I know it's a newer ship. For spring break, we're gonna be heading over to LA. We plan on checking out more of LA. I want to go to Rodeo Drive. I do. So you know we cannot go all the way to California and not go to Disneyland. So what I plan on doing is when we get off of the cruise, uh, we're going to drive to Anaheim, rent a car, drive to Anaheim, and go to Disneyland for at least a day. I want to do two, but that's pushing it. Um, they're going to be having a food and wine festival. That's what I've been waiting on. When I tell you their food and wine festival is the bomb, I'm talking about the food, like everything that we've tried. If you follow me on my, um, Disney channel, which is, is, it's, it's a little rusty over there. We got to wake, wake her back up. Cause I know it's a lot of Disney fans out there that watches this channel obviously because every time i throw a lounge fly bag on the website y'all eat it up even though we're a little dormant <laughs> over there on the other channel people are still watching because we still getting paid <laughs> we still getting a little little coins over there on that channel still getting views so we're gonna wake it up one day and try to stay consistent and um, vlogging is hard and it takes a lot of time and then with me doing velvety vibes and it being so successful it's, it's, it's a lot of work for me to run a small business and two channels. I appreciate it all. Lord knows I do. But it's hard. It's, it's hard. And um, I enjoy it, though. I enjoy every bit of it. So, yeah, I got a lot of these bags still. The one I wear the most is this one here because it was the most expensive. Like, we're going to get our cost per wear, per wear out of this night. It's, it's a beautiful bag. Like, I love it. And I get compliments every time I wear it. People ask them, where did you get that bag? I'm like, girl, it's gone. You had to get it. Shoot, I got it at the beginning of last year. When I want to wear a pop of yellow, I reach for this bag. This one is another most worn bag. I like the sequence. What's this? Oh, my uh, BJ's order is here. <laughs> so I like the sequence on this bag. But yeah, I like the I like to wear the bags with the sequins. This one I wear a lot. And this one I just got a couple months ago. So I've been wearing that. But I haven't worn it too much because I don't want it to get dirty. And then we got the Mickey, the red, white, and black down here. This one I just bought um in November doing lounge fly 
Black, uh, Black Friday sale. So I got that. It's just all red. It's so pretty. Little gold sparkly touches in there. And then this one is so cute. I wear all of these. Anything Mickey, I definitely wear. But um, yeah, this one is like a little cupcake. And then we got Minnie holding a cupcake. We got Mickey. And then this one I think was my first ever lounge fly bag. This one. And then I recently picked this one up. Uh, probably the summer of last year. Let me show y'all what I picked up real quick. What's this? Oh, <laughs> it was in there. I'm like, what is this? I bought some um, more of these lighters. This all from, came from BJ. BJ's. Peppers. A receipt. <laughs> Mango chunks. It's supposed to be button mushrooms, but I guess they ain't have any, so she substituted it for the portobello whole big mushroom. So, well, no, they were supposed to be portobello the uh, little small ones, but I guess they didn't have it. But this is okay. Um, I got this cherry berry and kale frozen fruit for a smoothie. The mangoes is obviously for a smoothie as well. We got some broccoli. Lastly, we got some chicken. The in sliced chicken breasts. I got two packs of those and then a pack of drumsticks. Okay, so this is what my little area over here is giving. The only thing that changed is me moving this shelf here, this black shelf. It was over in the corner and these two bookcases was pushed further down so you can see it's a little dusty i had like uh disney stuff up there like i said it was over there in that corner so i'm gonna wipe this down and put some purses there i wish it was white but i'm not buying another one this came from ikea by the way i do have two white ones but i'm using them in my office it, it matches though yeah so it's okay but yeah i just got all of my mcm because MCM deserves a whole bookcase in itself. So this is all of my MCM bags and backpacks. Um, up there, I got two eyeglass cases or sunglass cases. And then I got a backpack up there. Those two. I got my hats there. I got these two crossbodies there. I got my wallets here. Um, I, I put these shoes here because it just matches the vibe. These are the shoes I wear when I'm wearing um, an MCM bag. Between those, which I want some more of these. Like, I didn't almost ran these down. Like, well, y'all can't tell, but I wore these mugs so much. <laughs> these are my favorite. I haven't worn these in a minute. But, um, yeah, so that's that. Like I said, I'm going to put purses on that shelf. And then this is the two empty bookcases. I'm probably going to have to rearrange the shelves. I already began starting it, but I was like, well, let me pick up the camera because somebody, maybe one person might uh, care to, you know, see me arrange or, you know, see me do this. Yeah, and this is what this side looks like. These here is shoe boxes. I brought these up. I actually have a lot of them. <laughs> Y'all remember at the old house, I had a lot of these. And I brought them up because I thought I wanted to use them again, but I really don't. I mean, I might. So just, I'm going to move these out of the way. I might store my Crocs in them. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good idea. I'm going to move these four though and just keep these.
this is what it's giving and I love it the only thing I need to do is get some curtains over there to kind of jazz it up a little bit just some sheer curtains which I already got I just got to get a, a curtain rod let's do a little walkthrough real quick I already showed you the MCM bookcase over here put these here in place of the foam runners and then I just turned these around which I think I'm gonna turn them back around because I think I like them I don't know, it doesn't matter. So on this shelf, I was planning on putting purses, but I ain't even got that many purses. Like, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> this is all the purses that I got. So I just put these shoes on here. I still got two shelves right here. So over here, I decided to put this plant because I needed to jazz it up just a little bit. And I left two of the shoe boxes down there and those just have my Doshi and Gabbana shoes. I can't wait to wear these. I wore these a couple times, but I can't wait to wear these with either this bag or that bag or that bag or that bag. So yeah, that's that's definitely gonna be a vibe. I wore these a few times. These only wore once. Um, but I can wear these with though, well, I mean this, and I think when I wore these, I wore it with that bag. And I can wear it with that um coach backpack. Um, no, nah, that's doing too much. So you already seen this side over here. I put these two backpacks. These are my only backpacks, well, like of this size, besides my MCM. But I wear these two a lot, a lot. I love this Kate Spade. I don't know if I ever showed y'all this bag. I purchased this back in, I wanna say October. I purchased this at the Disney Springs Kate Spade. Right now it's on sale, y'all. It's on sale, but I paid full price for it which was like four something and i ain't even mad about it because i definitely already got my cost per wear i was gonna say cost per use cost per wear out of it already just look at it it's so freaking pretty you know i love a good quilted design the quality is amazing and i like the functionality of it so you can carry it like this or you know you can carry it like a backpack, which I never carry any backpack like a backpack, except for my lounge fly sometimes. But I always have it on one shoulder. It has a pouch back here so I can easily sit, slip my phone back here. Zipper compartment here. And it's big enough to hold like a little card holder or whatever. And then just turn that. And it has like a bone in here. Like, you see that? I love that you see it's like something is something hard in there that makes it you know to make it stay and then oh so sweet but yeah the inside of course got like receipts and stuff in here but it got a pocket here and then it got a pocket there I'm telling you this is a good buy like I said the last time I seen it they did have it on sale they had it in a uh, cream and gold color which is really pretty which I might not I'm think about it I might go and grab that bag if it's still on sale and they also had like a baby blue um well it was like a funny kind of blue and this gold i use this bag a lot this bag i purchased from zara for naya i wore it once i <laughs> only wore it one time and i'm probably gonna give it back to naya but um i just hung it there and this bag been on like basically every freaking vacation um i love it again quilted good material i purchased this at the bloomingdale's outlet at um sawgrass mills mall if y'all remember i purchased this one and i purchased the smaller one the smaller one is in silver and i think i gave that to maddie either naya or maddie got that one but i got this on sale for like i think 2.99 and it's worth every penny. Now, well, I'm saying of $2.99. Um, these are a little pricey because these go, I think these are like $700. I wouldn't pay that. But it is a very good bag. Very good bag. Um, it's not a thread out of place. It's been tossed, thrown around. I've took this on many, many vacations. I even took this to Vegas when me and Cleveland went on like that dune buggy 
If y'all remember, I took it on a doom buggy. It was no longer black. It was gray. It was so dusty. Oh no. I threw it in the washer and boom, it's good as new. Like I said, no thread out of place. It's, <laughs> the quality is so good. It looks brand new, brand new. So, love it. That was gonna stay there. And then over here, I got, you know, the Kate Spade heart bag that I just picked up. These two bags I had for at least four or five years. These were sent to me um, from a replica company that I don't remember. I did a video on it a long time ago. Here I got two LV bags that I picked up from Save Bullet. I've worn both of these quite a few times. Yeah, I've worn both of these quite a few times. I just love the little pop of pink that that gives. Ooh, why is that turned around? It's supposed to be like that. And then this one. Here I got my bum bags, waist bags. This is new. This is new and this is new. I don't think y'all seen this though. So I haven't wore any one of these yet. I wore the heck out of this one. <laughs> this is another one of my travel bags. And I love it because it's vinyl. If it's raining, the water just beads up and rolls off. This is a great travel bag. And this one I just purchased off of Saks, I believe. It was on sale. And this one uh, I got off of Nordstrom's. And it also was on sale. And then y'all remember when I picked this one up when we was at Sawgrass Mills Mall. So down here, I just got Gucci. All of these are replicas, except this. I purchased that from the Gucci store and I also purchased that from the Gucci store. But I purchased the small stuff, <laughs> cause it's fair, well I ain't gonna say cheap. It's, it's a lot cheaper than the bags. But this one I got, most likely all of these I got from Save Bullet. Yeah, most likely. Yeah, and then most likely I got all of them. And most likely I got And most likely I got all of these from Save Bullet. Down here, I have the Coach Tote. This bag was on sale at, I wanna say Nordstrom's or Saks. I love the color. I can't wait to wear this bag. It is so freaking cute. It's Tory Burch, obviously. Love the chiffron. It's suede, and like I said, it was on sale. I think it was originally like $600. 550 598 and I got it for 300 and I love the the snap closure I was reading a couple reviews where they said they like the Tory Burch better than the YSL bag because that's what it's kind of given the white not this one they said they own the YSL bag the all black one and they said they like the Tory Burch better because the magnet is stronger on the Tory Burch but yeah that's what the magnetic closure looks like and it's i, I love it <laughs> for some reason i like that that's what the inside looks like sorry i'm doing this with one hand and the chain is like this where you can either carry it on the shoulder or you can carry it crossbody and that one i got off of the h gate so down here i was able to put my shoe containers down here where well, i had to adjust the shelf and I just got a couple Crocs and my Birkenstocks. No, yeah, the rest is Crocs. The Crocs and Birkenstocks. And y'all see what's up there, like the bigger bags. And then right here, I got my black LV bags. All of these bags came from, not all of them. This one came from Save Bullet. This one came from Save Bullet. No, this one came from DH Gate years ago. Um, this one came from Save Bullet. No, this one came from DH Gate, and that one came from DH Gate. This one came from Save Bullet. Here I just got this little container here full of the what they call these SLGs, and all of this came from uh, DH Gate years ago. Though I haven't purchased purchased any new like wallets and stuff from DH Gate in a minute. This one was sent to me from. Uh, save bullet I believe and I got the one with the green strap 
this I got from Save Bullet. This I got from Save Bullet. And this is the newest bag from Save Bullet. This I got from DHgate. I bought this bag and the black one. It's the utility bag from DHgate. Um, this one from, you know, I got that one from DHgate and this one from DHgate. Then I decided to bring my sandals in here because y'all remember I had put them like on my tv stand like under my tv stand that shelf and i didn't like it it was uh, it just looked too sloppy and it is uh, it was not given <laughs> so i decided to move them in here so i just got all of my tory birch sandals up here got some louis vuitton sandals or slides that i got from dh gate a couple years ago some more tory birch and this right here is gonna be saved for some red ones. I gotta go get, I gotta get the red Tory Burch sandals. So that's what that spot is for. <laughs> and then I got these blue ones, which I can't wait to wear with either that. I can wear it with that. And I can wear it with that. I can wear it with that. So we're doing pretty good because that was the goal to make sure um, if I was going to buy anything, make sure that I have a shoe and shoe and a purse, you know, match up. Because I hate when I purchase a shoe and because it's cute or whatever, but I have nothing to go with it and it just sits. So now I'll make sure I have a purse to go with the shoe. I recently picked up these and y'all was asking me to leave the link. Girl, just go on Macy's. Y'all seen I was in the Macy's um, store. <laughs> yeah, just go on Macy's.com. Type in Steve Madden and these should come up. They got these in gold. They had them in silver. They got them in black and they were $90. You might can catch them on sale um, if Macy's having a sale. So then I got the Tory Burch dad sandals, which I can't wait to wear. Gucci slides, which I love. Like I want to buy another pair of these, but I haven't seen them on the website or anything. Like the sole is almost gone on these because I wore these so much and they are so comfortable. I mean, so comfortable. And I want to find more. Don't. It doesn't have to be like this print, but long as it's this style, I'm go walk in that Gucci store and buy some more. <laughs> these I got from DH Gate years ago. Y'all remember I bought these for Deja for her 16th birthday. I think I paid like five something for these, and that's the first time I ever paid that much for a shoe. Not just a slide for a shoe. Period. Flip flops that I purchased from Marshalls. What's these? Oh, these are my Gucci slides from DH Gate. Now, anything that I purchased from DH Gate years ago, I ain't gonna be able to find the link or anything because them links they be switching out and or no longer sell it or what have you. And then here I just got a bin full of slides and sandals. And then that's just stuff. But yeah, I love it. I am very satisfied. It's practical. For me, I can see everything. That's the thing. That's what I really wanted. I wanted to be able to see all of my bags because some of these bags I had behind my door, like on a hook behind my door. But um, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this little rearranging organization. Oh, I forgot to put this bag up there. But this is a Never Fool that looks kind of like that bag over there. And the same seller shipped that to me like i said years ago so um yeah got that and then this bag up here i also got from um a seller sent it to me years ago so i'm at the end of vlog but before i do i got two more bags that i'm gonna put on the website so you know the first bag that's on there if it's not gone yet because i did mention that small prada bag earlier in this vlog so i'm pretty sure somebody didn't clicked off and ran over there and purchased it but who knows maybe not maybe still available so i got another prada bag for you this one i purchased off of dh gate about two years ago naya wears the black one to death she don't wear this one because she don't like the color and i don't like this bag because it's too small but yeah it's very good detail and then the inside got prada written all in there so I just got this one off of DH Gate. I wore it one time when we went to the movies and I don't know, it's too big. <laughs> Look, I'm always talking about is something too small or something too big. What I think I'm gonna do is go on Save Bullet and get the um, East West 
the one that's shorter. I think I would like that one better. Another thing, I don't like the way it looks on me as a crossbody. Yeah, like I said, I wore it once and you know, all the detailing is there. Um, I don't want to go into too much because if you watch my DH gate haul, you already seen uh, everything. So yeah, I'll put this on the website as well. And the money I get from these two bags, I'm gonna put towards the LV bag that I really want. Right now I'm about to edit this vlog and try to get this out to y'all today. It is 2.40. So if I start now, I'll be done by seven probably. And if I do something else later, I'll just start a whole nother vlog because this vlog should be pretty long for y'all. And don't forget to thumbs up the video. And shout out to the ones that come in thumbs up the video. I really appreciate it. Um, it helps me a lot. Even when you comment, even when you thumbs down the video, it helps me because YouTube see it as engagement. I mean, as long as you don't have like more thumbs down than thumbs up, <laughs> you good. It'd be a few of y'all thumbs down the video, but that's okay. It's okay. And you know, if you comment, good or bad <laughs> that's considered as get engagement as well and shout out to the ones that comment on every single video zai girl <laughs> i think i thanked you yesterday um when i went live and y'all check off the laugh because i got a little little deep <laughs> it's two hours but i mean you could choose to sit through and watch it or skip through if you want to but um, yeah, I got a little deep over there. I, I called up my childhood best friend. I did a little bit of cooking on there in the meatloaf. Um, yeah, we got a little deep over there. And it's a lot of stuff that I share. I always share on my live that I don't on a vlog. And I think that's because people uh, ask questions and then that's how it comes up. So yeah, as always, thanks for watching. You know I love you. See you in the next one.